took me just about a full hour to do all of what we were going to do off stream. But for those of you who don't know, let me show you something fun. I have been buying and saving up every single piece of bait. Okay, not all of them. I haven't really gotten all the ones that just you just get while walking around too much. I, I haven't been particularly thorough on that point. Like, there's still blue magical ghost gas just everywhere that I haven't picked up. Those might have been bait. I didn't get those, but every single time I had the option to... We, even I missed a month, too, because I could have unlocked the Southern Merchant effectively a month sooner by doing it earlier in the month than exploring again. So this is still somewhat inefficient, but I bought every single piece of bait that I could from when I had access to, and I found the occasional pieces of bait along the ride, and then I did the quests. I waited specifically for the Fistfuls of Fish event, and I had so much bait. This took me about just over an hour to fish through all of it. But the reason why the Fistfuls of Fish is such an important event is because when you catch something, you can get two to four. I think that's... I, I think it goes up to four. You get two fish, up to four, maybe five, but I don't remember seeing a five. When you use one piece of bait. And that's really important for if you get a red or even a gold fish. Even a small blue fish, which is normally the worst one because those don't pay for themselves... They have a chance to pay for themselves. Not very high chance, but they can. And you want to know? I had about 40, nearly 50 of the three cheap baits, and about 25 of both the most expensive baits. Hello there. Do you know how many fucking fish I have? Oh, look at the piles of money I have! Because I could just come in here. This one, yes. 19,000. Boom, easy. This one, yes. 21,000. I only got two silverfish because yes. apparently I'm a god. I think so this much yes. fucking money. And I'm gonna sell them till I. And then I'm I gonna sell these. And then I can even hold on to yes. the rest of them and be like, hey, it doesn't even matter that I much because I can still yes. use the rest of these fish for food time. That's super good. I think Who doesn't yes. want to do that? Look I at all this money this I'm yes. getting. Even the cheap ones. Even the cheap ones, they're like, oh, this sells for $10. Oh, that's fine. Thank you. Don't gotta worry about it. You know, when you're selling 40 of them, it's still a little bit of income. That's pretty fucking nice. It's a little bit tedious, but I put on a podcast, and I had breakfast. And by the time I was done, I was like halfway done with the bait. Even these ones, the white trout that only sell for 10 that are just kind of worthless, I got a shitload of them. Now, I'm not going to sell the Caledonian Crayfish and the Armored Gobi because they sell for one. I can just use them as a filler food item. You know, the ones that just require fish in general. That's value. 64,000. I started with over 9,000. I gained 55,000, roughly, money from one day of fishing. Return soon, please. I hey, am. Welcome. Fine. You have a good eye. Unironically, like $20,000 worth of seats. That might be too much, actually, now that I think about it. But that should, this should carry through, through most of the game. Come again. I don't even know what I did last time. I don't even remember what we... Apparently, I still have teacher points. I didn't even check. Have I done, have I done gardening yet? I don't know. It's been, it's been like three days. Yes, I've done gardening. The fish that are the, the flowers that I'm planting to get speed carrots are well, fine. And you get multiple fistful of fish events. In <laughs> Even if you didn't want to do that for a full hour, just buy the two most expensive ones, right. go on a fistful of fish, the fistful of fish date, Hello there. and try to force yourself to get yellows. Just go for yellows. Because at most, one platinum and one goldfish, even just a platinum, will already pay for all of the bait you've bought. For one full month of like doing good stuff, it's just and that easy. And I now don't even have money Unlike problems anymore. The problem I is solved. Now I gotta do quests, I guess. I don't even. We have a bunch of social links I still need to do because we never even finished. But I'm gonna wait on the social links because I wanna get everything ordered. 
I'm gonna do the food more hour set because technically that gives friendship. I want to get the items sorted out because I'm able to reforge fucking everybody. And now they're a dancer. Okay. Now I can make Dorothy my dancer. Nice. See, that, there was another one. I missed it. You know what? That's just free value right there. That's all that is. That's good shit. That's another pawn snail. I don't know what tier that is. But you know what? I can show it off. Here, here's, the, here's the method of the madness. I'll do it one time for everyone. Just to show you what I did off stream. Just because I don't think anyone wanted to see me sit here for genuinely like an hour. This is a low tier one. Tier one and tier two, I typically don't force. Uh, the yellows, which are the rarest one, I go for reds if they can. Just because they are so rare. Like in all my time of fishing through like 50 of both, I got one yellow. I think in the entire time. Maybe one for both, but I don't remember. Out of like almost 50 bait, I got one each. It's just, it's just not worth it. So you come in here. You see what you're going to get. Don't want that. That's a small blue. Those are terrible. Don't go for that. We want to force a red. That's a big blue. Nice. Not what we want. You have to take the third one no matter what, because otherwise the bait will get away. Be efficient, God. And it's just that easy. But, because it's still Fistful of Fish Day, we got a Tetanus Loach. But we also got another Tetanus Loach. And an Armid Pike, and another Armid Pike. Four times. At the very least, a 300% increase in value. Or 400, I don't know, numbers, they're weird. It was a vast increase in value. And that's what's important. That's the key thing. That makes me feel good inside. Let us make good friends with one another, shall we? Today's the day for some bonding bites. Ooh, eating Of fucking course it's Felix. Felix and Caspar apparently don't have a whole lot in common when it comes to food. Because even if you don't get as many fish or you don't get a lot of the gold ones, hey, that's fine. I can use this fish for this right here. Because if you get that many fish, you pretty much never need to worry about... Um likes again. This is actually was the weirdest combination. I'm unironically bringing up, oh, you don't have to worry about food combinations anymore because you have, because like, you don't need to worry about the garden as much because I'm using it for speed carrots. I've never seen a combination like this. Felix and Caspar have almost nothing that they like together. Like, Felix at most is medium and Caspar genuinely doesn't like any of the food. I don't know if that's just Caspar. He might just not like food. But hey, you know, I just got wild game, that might actually help. But there's actually a problem that we can solve, and there's a way of resolving this issue without actually needing to interact with these mechanics. We can shore up the downsides. Hey, welcome. You have a Buy a good little eye. bit of poultry. Oh, Buy a little bit of wild have game. A good eye. It's okay, a little expensive, I'm sure, but mm, fuck it. It's not really what you want to be doing with your free time, but doing quests, any food you happen to scrounge up from the garden, Professor. They should help curb the tides. Because you got fish for fucking days, bro. You got fish. You just need a carrot and some wild game. And I think we already get carrots, because speed carrots the thing we're going for. Easy game. <coughs> I can eat so much of this. That looks... And now they're better friends. It's just that easy. Let's see if anyone else needs any more. No, we're done. Now, where is Dorothea? Over here. Hey, you want to be a dancer, lady? I wonder if Remire Village will ever be the same with so many dead. So much... I'm sorry, Professor. It's a big dance contest between the classes, and I simply adore dancing. I'm quite good at it. Since I was... I think my heart just skipped a beat. You want me to represent the class? I'm not sure when I... No, don't give her a gift. Try to teach her. Hey, professor. You're here to help. There you go. Plus five charm. Even if this, even if they don't even uh, need the charm, you can just give this to someone else. Like I don't know how it really works. You know, 
<laughs> but plus five charm is actually like massive. That is a huge spike to the charm stat. Damn, son. I don't know if you can give that dull dancing mechanic to someone else. Like, oh, hey, this person's got, you know, 35 charm. I don't need to train them. I don't know if you can give that to someone else. Like, hey, hey, Hubert, you want to learn how to be a dancer? I'm not even making you be a dancer. You want plus five charm? I don't know if it works like that, but it'd be nice if it did. I got... How the fuck... How does this quest work? Give me a second. I guess we're done, then. I guess it'll just happen automatically. Frankly, I'm not sure, because I don't remember. I just want to be certain about these things. Or something else I was going to do. Oh, that's right. Inventory management. We did just get n uh, nearly 55,000 gold all in one month, so... I think it's time to go shopping. See what everyone has just toting around. The fuck off, Italian guy. Hey Give me this. That's what we like to see. Oh, man, your hand axe is looking a little rough. Is Boom. This it? It's there fixed now. It's an improved product. Oh, your hand axe is looking a little rough? Here, let me fix it for you. There you go. I got all the money, baby. I don't got to worry about it anymore. Is Luckily, smithing it? stones and whatnot's really cheap and easy to get. Woot steel... That's a little bit more of a pain in the ass, but smithing stones, you just throw money at the problem. Be rich is the problem solver. What do you even have? Training sword? What? Petra, what Come the fuck do you time. even have equipped right now? Do you seriously only have three weapons? Oh, lord. Okay, you know what? Pro priority number one is where is the weapon shop? There we go. Just... Just give me the good stuff. A brave sword, give me one, one of those. Leaven sword, you're gonna need one, one of those. Like things. two killing it, like a killing edge at least. Things. Uh, brave lance, at least a killer lance. Many things. Short spear. I just just buy everything I'm gonna need for the whole time. You know what? Buy some silver stuff too. Will Buy one of all of them. Things. I'm gonna tear Will into my money things. reserves, Many but things. I'm splurging. Many things. We're pretty much done, you know. This one do? Many th this they're also one-time use. Like you can't this buy anymore. Like Many they're things. limited to one, you know. Will this one do? Many things. Spent like forty thousand dollars on weapons, but we're fine. <laughs> you know what? We're going to do a hard reset on everybody. A little bit of a tedious time, but it helps us plan out and see what we need. It's a little tedious. I know not everyone wants to deal with it, but I would not 100% say I'm experienced enough in this game to be able to plan on the fly, and I like to be thorough. It's better to be certain rather than to fuck up, you know? Like, the Blessed Lance I'm not giving anyone else. It just, that just benefits her. That's a nice thing. Okay, Violet. He's going to be a sword dude and a magic dude. So, really just swords. So, steel sword and iron sword. I guess he doesn't really need the steel sword. But we only have one silver sword, and I probably would like to give that to Petra. Because she doesn't have as high base strength. So she needs the extra oomph. And then, everyone's got to get a training weapon, though. Just They're disgusting. And... Does this become garbage. Hey, you know what? Take a steel sword plus. There you go. That'll be a that'll be a nice happy medium. And ah, frankly, there's just no reason not to tote around a plus version of a training sword. If I'm going to be bringing it around, I might as well have it be broken. Oh, he needs a vulnerability. Better be safe than sorry. Edelgard, you're an axe person, 100%. So, here are some axes. Silver axe, killer axe, training axe plus, and we have a bunch of other stuff. Silver axe and killer axe are for murder, training axe is for chip, and then... Is this a throw? That's a... There you go, there's... Yeah, done, easy. He's a mage, he doesn't give a damn. 
He is also an axe boy, I believe. So, the same, the uh, second verse, same as the first. You know what? Instead, I'll give you a steel axe because I don't think we have another silver. Oh, we're also out of killers. Here, I'll, make, I'll give you an iron one that you can make a killer later. Lindhart, also a mage man, don't care. Caspar, he's a fist dude with a splash of axes. So just like before, I'm going to give him a big boy axe just to be able to punch through stuff and a short axe just because he's a fist dude. He needs a ranged attack, but he's primarily still going to be the fist guy. It's very easy and simple. Here's your training gauntlets. Here's your silver gauntlets. Go have fun. Don't hurt yourself with those. Archer. You're definitely worse off than Felix, so Silver Bow. Hmm. I think I'm going to hold on to the Brave stuff for right now, because, let's be frank, I can only buy one of them, and they are like bringing a tank to a knife fight. That's a little bit much. Even the Silver stuff, that's pretty huge for right now, but it's not Brave level of cheese, and frankly... I don't want to have to deal with trying to fix these bastards. I'd rather have more niche, generally applicable solutions rather than just the nuclear bomb solution that I only have one of. Mini bow, silver bow. I don't know, you don't really have a whole lot of bows. <laughs> a training bow, I guess, and a steel bow. I, I don't know. I don't really have a game plan for you guys. <laughs> There's not a whole lot of bow. I don't have a lot of the more fun, spicy bows yet. She's going to be a dancer, so here's your Levin Sword. Also, don't hurt yourself with that either. That That's also important. Petra. A sword person with a splash of bows. Armor Slayer, because you need good damage. Silver Sword, because you need good damage. Training Sword, because light weapons. Killing Edge, because assassin. Fairly obvious. And a bow. Here's a steel bow. I, who, who gives a damn? Bow. She has a silver bow. She does have a silver bow. Ooh. Yeah, I don't really have anything fancy for him. <laughs> it really kind of sucks. Like I, I don't have anything to give him. Uh, here's an axe because you can technically wield them. Because, I mean, you're a brigand, but he never needs to... No, I'll be tempted to use it. Ah, fuck it. He just only has these. My Scythia, Mage, don't care. Flame, I'm not even using. And we're done. Just that easy. Now I can actually finish what I was starting to do. Hey there. And do this. And does anything need to be fixed? Is there, okay, you know, make that just already fix this. There's no reason not to. It's it? it's literally 210 gold and 40 smith and four smithing stones. That's nothing, but it vastly increases the efficiency of the training weapons because it lowers their weight, which effectively guarantees a double. That's just do it. Why wouldn't you? Before I had infinite money. Yeah, I can understand it. You know, got to save those pennies. They add up over time. But right now, no, you're fine. Now we fix things like this. Hey, don't this want that to break. There you go. They're even cheaper to repair. Look at this. They're two smithing stones for 180 gold. You get that for selling like two fish. That's so cheap. One gold fish pays for that twice over. Actually, I do need to fix it for silver a little bit, but it's not too bad. Is this it? There you go. All right, here we go. Come back anytime. Save it up. And time to watch shitload of support conversations. Wait, pick a student into the dance competition. Didn't I already... Why is it still giving me that text box? Didn't I already do that? Dorothea, I just did the dancing thing with you. Is this not what you want? How was that? How was that? Was my dancing every... Yeah, no, like... Donatelli Zakamon Whale, isn't she the 
a lady on a mission. I hear you've chosen your repers you on an average year. The winning can 13 of this. You think I think Dorothy is fine. <laughs> Yeah, she blows it out of the fucking water. Okay, time to shut my mouth and listen to just a fuck-ass load of support conversations. Let's get the shitty ones out of the way with the worst girl. Bernadetta, if you have a moment, I would like to discuss what happened before. Oh, my nemesis! The hour of fate arrives! Help! I am not here to hurt you. You need not even open the door. Just listen to me. I don't have to open the door? Is this a truce? Okay, okay, I like truces. Thank you. I would like to apologize for sticking my nose into your business the way I did. I thought you might be unhappy all cooped up in there, and that maybe I could help. But I've had time to reflect on what you said, and I realize I was mistaken. Oh, um... Thanks for caring, but I'm fine, actually. I see that. I suppose that is what I'm trying to say. I should not have pushed you to do something that you did not wish to do. And for me to frighten you like that? That was unbecoming conduct for a noble. Maybe a little bit. Frankly, I am embarrassed by my behavior. Gotta, gotta represent myself. Ferdinand being the wholesome lad injury, he is, but also Bernadette is a stupid bitch, and he's trying his damnedest to fix what's already broken. Not anything you did. I have always strived to be a good person, but I suppose all that striving was for nothing. I have failed in my duty as a noble. Um, Ferdinand? Yes, Bernadetta? really know much about this sort of thing but you shouldn't say things like that about yourself it wasn't all your fault you know I'm to blame too I hurt you and I'm sorry really it is fine it healed quickly and it wasn't for nothing either I am not so sure I do like my time alone actually it's more of a need but you're right I also need to venture out every once in a while. Maybe, if I work as hard as you do, I can try it a little more. Yes, keep working at it. You are already much more outgoing than you used to be. When I mess up, or even when it's just a bad day, it's hard for me to step outside. I'm too scared. But the next day, I try again. Because I know that one mistake... This is all really nice and good character growth, but so it feels mistake. unearned. With every single one of her other confrontations, she's been violently and cartoonishly antagonistic to the concept of people. And now she's like, I can do it! Doesn't... There hasn't been growth. It just happened at me. Like, this seems like a different person talking right now. That's not growth. They've just done... They've flicked a light switch and the light has come on saying, Hey, we're a different character now. We've grown, except I'm not even talking to the same person anymore. Well, let's hope that gets better. Because it's not even just C-Ranks anymore. Uh, a little more crimson, maybe? May I suggest Vermilion instead? Vermilion! And you see what I mean? I, see it. You don't have to say I know they're not directly related to one another, but fucking A. I said nothing about your talent. I simply suggested Vermilion over Crimson. Do you know Vermilion? It's just a softer shade of Crimson. I believe it would... They'll forget it. This is your artistic vision, and I am a <laughs> I am going to read my book and leave you to your art. Ah, oh, forget it. Ah, oh, fuck <laughs> this. <laughs> Leonard's not what dealing with your bullshit. It's good advice. I'll use Vermilion. Ah, oh, forget it. Oh, whatever, man. Who gives a damn? Well, I'd best be heading back. Phew! Finally done! I think. All finished? Everything looks a bit faded, doesn't it? Ironically, Crimson may have been a better choice after all. 
The sense of distance on the pedals is a little strange. Perhaps you should pay closer attention to such details as you paint. A preliminary sketch would do wonders. Still, it... Oh, forget my pedantic comments. You really do have potential. <sighs> And we shit post Turn music. Better. Oh, idiot! Hopeless! Waste of charm! Just burn the whole thing, Bernie! Break your stupid brushes and never paint again! Huh. Perhaps I should have kept my thoughts to myself. That's her problem if she can't take criticism. That's quite literally the most most constructive criticism. Hi. Well, well, if it isn't Bernadetta, what brings you here? Am I bothering you? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I'll come back another time. Even Lindhart said, "Ah, fuck just it, I'll just keep here. it to myself." But oh, there she goes again. To talk about? Uh, yes. Do you remember that time in town? In town? Oh, you mean when all those thieves showed up? <laughs> That was rough. I heard a bunch of people got robbed. No, not that. I mean the time I was... carried off. Some thieves tried to carry you off? Horrible. Absolutely horrible. Just tell me which way they went. <laughs> I'm gonna... That's not what I mean. Oh, just forget it. Wait, don't go. What are you trying to ask me? Will you really listen this time? Bernadetta, you're one Sorry. to speak. Not my full attention. Do you remember when you carried me to that spot with a really pretty view? Where is that place? I've been looking all over. The place I took you with a view. Oh, right. Okay, first you go out of the monastery, and actually it's kind of tricky to explain. Come on, I'll just take you there again, but pay attention this time. What's more endearing to Caspar's character is that his default position, that his default reasoning is I'm going to lift you and take you there. Have I actually not done Oh, I was gonna say, how have I not done one with Petra yet in Bylip? That's cause I keep waiting for it to be a morale reset, but that shit just never happens. She and Dorothea never offer to talk to Byleth passively. You're a morale reset. It's more efficient like that. Uh, once we get near the time skip, I'll throw them all down if we're not there yet, but... Um... Dude, I like Caspar. We'll do one of his. Caspar, I've been wondering something. Would you be happy <coughs> if you were the heir to House Burglies? Of course. My brother probably wouldn't be too happy about it, though. I've got nothing against him, and I'd hate yeah, to cause him trouble. Fucking Miklon should talk to Caspar, Jesus. You may not want to hear this, but your brother is not a good man. Just like, hey, Miklon, hey! He's so greedy, and has always relied on the knowledge that he would inherit a title. That's my impression. <laughs> oh, God, no. Anyway. <laughs> you don't hold anything back, do you? But to be honest, you're not too far off. He's got good reason for it, though. Our grandfather was really obsessed with his second wife. She has a son who she really wanted to become the heir. In the end, though, my grandfather had to step down sooner than expected, so everything went to my father instead. You know what? I didn't get a fair shake of it. I want to comment on this before I forget about it. It becomes less topical. I do appreciate some of the occasional comedic social links. The one with Bernadette and Casper wasn't bad. I'll say that one. That 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 one was another. That one was not too bad. I'm not just gonna hate on Bernadette. I want to be fair. It one wasn't too bad. My brother is still really worried about having his future taken from him. That's the price of taking your own desires into account when choosing an heir. The concept of nobility is decaying, and it's dragging the empire into the ground with it. Wow, this conversation is really going there. You may be right, but it's not like the world is ever going to change, right? It must. I intend to create a world where the best are free to rise to the top and succeed, regardless of their bloodline. 
The nobility as it is now could not exist in a world like that. I'll make sure of it. What do you think would happen to me in that kind of world? Would you appoint me as a general or minister of military affairs? If you were the best suited for that position, I would. Right, so my life would pretty much stay the same. I'd still have to train, get stronger, and use my abilities to cut my own path. I don't know what I'm gonna do after we graduate. I guess I'll just have to fight for you. Is that so? At the base, the front lines, or wherever we might be fighting, I'll be there with all my might. <laughs> and then he just violently runs off after doing a battle cry. Caspar, are you sure you're all right? Like, <laughs> like in the head? <laughs> <laughs> hey there, Hubie. I've been thinking about our conversation the other day, and I've just got to know, do you really love Aidy? If it's one or the other, I suppose it would be closer to love than to hate. Why? Ah, uh, I knew it! That's why you work so hard for Aidy. Oh, Hubie, I finally get you. You're just another servant suffering from unrequited love for their mistress. <laughs> you completely misunderstand. I mean, in a unrequited loose sense. Love. Do I really look like the kind of drooling simpleton to have that kind of motivation? I'd like to say yes, but I know you just argue. Fine, Hubie. Tell me your situation. My situation is simple. I am walking a path. Oh, do go on. Everyone has a path in life. Lady Edelgard has shown me mine. It is just beside her own. So we walk together side by side. We stride ever forward, yielding to nothing and to no one. So, you're sharing the same dream? <laughs> Bluntly, yes. But it's more than just a shared dream. I have many feelings toward Lady Edelgard. Gratitude, respect, awe, empathy, trust, hope. Okay. Yes, I was bullet. teasing you, but I gotta say I'm just a little bit jealous of you and Aidy. That you're able to embrace these feelings and stride forward along the same path. You're lucky, Hubie. I don't know if I'll ever get the chance to experience anything so utterly operatic. Why not? Because I figure the best quality in a partner would be that they make me happy. And loving another is really about wanting to be loved. I'm pretty sure that's different from how things are with you and Aidy. Okay. Welcome, Bullet, to the We're Finishing Off the Social Links after I made uh, about $55,000 peddling fish and I have fully decked out my entire team with super gear. And then I spent all that money Looking on silver weapons and already. brave weapons and killer weapons, yes. oh my. <laughs> there are some times I cannot stop my thoughts from going home. It will be much time before I return. Oh, also $20,000 worth of uh, gardening seeds. It is quite a long way. To say nothing of the sea that lies between here and there. Being unable to return must further add to the distance in your mind. It is as you say. When I return to Bridget, I will be the new queen. I am wishing to help relations with the Empire. I believe you will be successful. You may not be Lady Edelgard's equal, but you are resourceful enough to make an excellent queen. And unlike Lady Edelgard, you will not be forced to harden your heart. Not Edelgard's equal? Is that what you are saying? Understand that I mean no disrespect by this. But it is a fact that you are far beneath her. I don't. I there think you should take that with a grain of salt, Petra. It's coming from Hubert. And revolt against her. She would crush you mercilessly. That is not a difference of equal of equality. It is a difference of power. Even if our homelands were on equal footing, Lady Edelgard would still prevail. I can see with clarity the difference between me and Lady Edelgard. But that has no matter. I would never lose. 
<laughs> How amusing. For your sake, you had better hope you are right. <laughs> Neat. Okay. Doke. Uh, we've done all of our quests. We've. I guess I can go see what this battle would be. And other than that, then that's gameplay time. What do we have today? Silver Shield. Not bad, but not great either. Time to start getting more Byleth grinding done. Have I done the. There it is. Wait, I don't know if I've done the magical friendship box yet. Let's see how well I can make people happy. I'm in cleaning. I always end up singing a song that I make up on the spot. It's so embarrassing if someone hears me. What should I do? I, I guess. And yeah, none of them sounded great, though. Words can express my disgust for the students here. Ooh, many of these fools rhyme the noble status with a crest pod excuse to shirk their training. Should spar with them. It's fucking Felix. I was gonna say this. <laughs> he better stamp them down. It's Felix. I mean, if it's an excuse to fight, he is on board. <laughs> Just like I did before, I think I am going to slowly grind up Hubert, because I'm not going to actively train his faith, but I'm going to passively train his faith using the choir, because he doesn't know heal yet. Terrible, and I don't want to actively train to. his faith. Must die. I know you hate it, and I know he gets like four points each time, but it's the fucking choir festival. And once he gets to heal, it won't matter anymore. Now quickly, every single person in the entirety of this building start teaching me how to wield a sword better. And what do you mean I'm already at A+, and we're barely a fourth of the way through the game? That's not, that's not justification for me slack in my training. Has become a better sword. I'll become the greatest sword of all the Lord. This is. Unfortunately, Yuritsa has uh, fucked off out of existence, so I can't really grind off of him anymore. Oh, you're not a teacher. Actually, now that I think about it, I would assume Daddy O is probably indisposed of right now because he's doing mission things. Where is. Oh, there's Catherine. Okay. That's what I wanted to see. He's just gonna say, like, Geralt's not here, Yuritz is not here, because obviously. Tomas technically isn't here, but he is irrelevant. No, no. Hmm, look at this just mosh pit going on right here. Hey! Hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> hey, I'm walking here. It wasn't risk. Does that surprise? That's true. People call it. Oh, I hear you. On an average year, the winning charm is. That's that. Ah, the ball. I was at a village's harvest festival. She appeared out of nowhere, dancing grace. We soon fell in love oh. and tied the knot. So, whenever Why I Why don't I get to see Eloise's daughter? That sounds like a fun time. I can't learn anything from you. You're worthless. Complete trash character. Can't even teach me how to wield a sword. Or be a horse. Uh... The fuck do I even do with my damn time? Because all I have left is Aloise, Shamir, and and and, that, and that's it. <laughs> Gerald, come back! I need your instructions. What says the ball? It's an event. Aloise, he volunteers. Ah, well, fuck it. Might as well do this. I have nothing else to spend my time on. Black magic. Okay, who has the best res? Sixteen. Ooh, solid ass twenty. Linhart's throwing out numbers. Get fucked, Hubert. Yeah, that's what we like to see. 
by all the hot magic the slinging action we have going on on screen as Lindhart proceeds to two-tap every single person in existence. And I didn't even enjoy it. Do I even need to heal? Actually, yeah, no, I don't. He, I would have to miss twice for this, for this man to lethal me. Victory. <laughs> this is a faith. Or this is a reason tournament. This bro's coming in here with a faith spell. Dirty, dirty cheater. Unbelievable. The audacity of such a man. Dirty cheaters. All of them. Let me review my notes, because I do actually have notes. Edelgard, done. Hubert. What does he still need? Lancey. Nah, he's not done. He needs to get A and everything. Ferdinand. Uh, A and... Oh, same shit as Hubert. Lindhart. He's pretty much done. Caspar. Actually done. Huh. Bernadetta is definitely gonna need some work. Oh shit, that's right. Yeah, she needs a buttload of axe. I completely forgot. I'm I still need to make her a fucking brigand. <laughs> ah, that's right. I forgot to put I forgot I adapted my notes to account for I want to make her a brigand, so she has not gotten any axe training this whole time. Dorothy, I can now just forget for the rest of the game because she's gonna become a dancer by the end of this month. Uh isn't she done? Ooh. Technically, no. She needs sea lances. But actually not anymore, because I needed sea lances to help with becoming a Pegasus Knight. And, I don't know if you've noticed, she's already a Pegasus Knight. So, irrelevant now. He also still needs work, and Lysithia is, of course, Lysithia. And is fine. So, no. <laughs> We're good. Come on, there you go. Now let me look over these. Hey, okay. uh, he needs some work. He only has B in horses. I'm gonna have to train Hubert for a while to get him back all caught up. Ferdinand, only Bs, especially only B plus in flying. That needs definitely needs some work. Remember, I need to get... If I'm working towards a stat, probably going to need to become A. Edelgard, done. She's an A. Hubert, not so much, because he doesn't have any A's. Caspar, he's an A in Fist. He's fine. Lindhart, technically not fine, because he doesn't need an A in Faith. He needs an A in Reason. So we'll have to look that over. She's also almost done. No, I have three more training points, I guess. Um... I guess Caspar's fine. Actually, it is very important to level up Caspar, though, because of all the fair skills, Fist Fair is probably the most valuable, How? just inherently, because it's a forced double, you know? So getting Fist Fair should probably be priority number one. If I'm going to be training anyone who's already done, Caspar's Cas pretty high up there. Same with the mages. They're another high priority. Like Lysithia? Well, nice. Petra's not done yet. Petra is now done. One. Petra's also cheating because I'm leveling up swords, and I'm better than her, so she's just getting a flat plus two to all of these. May I be a... I'm having a question which I improve my land skills, but I'm uncertain having a certainty how to be efficient training effectively. What should I be doing? Uh try something stronger than yourself. Yeah, okay. Professor. No. 
Lance and riding. Ugh. Bernadetta. Great. Um, what is it? Thanks so much. Relaxing at the sauna? Nope. Things that bother you? And... Are racing. Fuck. None of those seemed like something she'd even want to... Well, here it goes to show you how much I know about Bernadetta. Or care about Bernadetta more aptly. Because none of the... Of her character, she likes to stay inside and hates people. I don't know if you noticed, that is... Very, very restrictive of what you can talk about. Because I thought, oh, relaxing in a sauna, that's Nothing relaxing. You don't need to be people in a sauna, that's just chilling out, Amazing. being mellow. Nope, that's obviously, what are you, stupid? That's a dumb thinking right there. Think better next time. Ah, oh, shit, you're right. How could I have been such a fool? I hear you. on an average charm is I hear you. on an Wait, average what? charm is Oh okay Hey, there's that Caspar Felix meal again. I just, I got a Petra and Felix are like priority number one for feeding because they uh, hate everything. All of it. Oh, and Hubert. Hubert's another prime example of I hate everything. God damn it. What is up with this household having such conflicting tastes in food? You seem to dine with co Yeah. Who does he get to eat with? Eh, sure. You know, sometimes I forget to eat. When I think of the past, it makes me... That's that people call well, the fuck is gonna be toting around crit plus ten before Geralt's even Geralt it. Not... <laughs> before Geralt's even Geral Geronimo off this mortal coil. I kind of I kind of floundered with the the execution of that bit. It wasn't even a good bit, but eh. it's it's the attempt. That's what matters. Didn't Lindhart also just learn war? That's super nice. Yeah, I think it actually gives him four or five faith, so he needs quite a few more choir sessions. But eh, it's not it's not that big of a deal. Hey you. <laughs> Before the each the student it is the I have from I have all these almost And just like that the glory Now we're working towards sword fair.
I can almost kind of ignore swords a, l a little bit more, you know? We could passively generate that through battle, and I could start focusing down trying to get movement plus one. I'm not gonna do that, but I will actively focus out the teachers who teach horses. There's not as many, so I'll still get sword training in, but just, you know, at a slower rate. Okay, you know what? Oh my god, he's one short fucking Hubert. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. I need heart done, Caspar done. Bernadetta needs just a fuckload of axe experience. It only needs to be C, so it's not too bad, you know, but... She unfortunately is terrible at it, which definitely puts a damper on things. Yeah, I'm gonna train it guard up a bit. Just in case something similar to with Dimitri happens. I want to get her at least above or ahead of the pack, just in case I miss out for a while. God damn it, Lindhart. Any goals that need to be reworked? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, now they're fine. Professor. Lance in writing. Uh, no. <coughs> what on earth is? Oh, Ladies oh, it's this. My sincerest apologies. We we know. Chris online. We we know. We we understand. We we've seen this before. Last but not least. I am I am like skimming a little bit to see if there's any dialogue. Like this is the bit that's. Are you ready to dance? And is the band? Dimitri is obviously the dancer of choosing when you go the blue boy route. <laughs> I didn't I didn't even think you could make the Lord the dancer. <laughs> That's so weird. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, I'm gonna be king and I have coasted my 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 whole army, not through my rare gross tactics, not through my battlefield prowess, but by having the sickest fucking dance moves of the entire army. Claude becoming a dancer. I'm already seeing it happening. Probably not, but I do think it'd be funny. <laughs> it already is funny. <laughs> the fuck are you doing, AI? Why are you like this? <coughs> Thank you. How warm and comforting. So it is. The last yeah. battle. Yeah. So it is. Is that oh, shit? I know I wanted the ideal professor. No. So it is. Blah blah blah. Yeah. I tried to Thank hit right on the treat. last I one, but it didn't time. read my input. I would love to do this again. Or I didn't push it down hard enough. I don't know. There are, there are multiple co cosmic events. Uh, who could have foreseen such a thing? It is done. I'd never have learned this back in and my room. Closer. Okay. Don't know what that is, but hmm. So. I right. appreciate Ooh, your effort. nice. So right now we need to check 
top of everything else, we now need to look at our abilities and combat arts again. Like, hey, sword crit, sorry, Axe Breaker, but you're kind of terrible. Okay, it's not bad, obviously, but it's too niche. Like, why would I have plus 20 avoid against axes, which does make me better against axes, when I could literally just have a flat plus 5 HP to everything. Magic, environmental damage, ballistas, monsters, everything. All types of damage. It's better than even... It's even better than just plus two defense in some cases. Just because it affects everything. Because it's a flat value. It's actually... Re I mean, you replace it late game, obviously. But it, for right now, it's not bad. Death b b b below Like, Axe Prowess, get the hell out of here. I'd rather do just a flat plus six strength during combat with a brawly boy. And he has plus two strength already. This man's a mad lad. And now the game rapidly changes for her. Faith, get that out of here. We give Sword Avoid for plus 20. Plus 20 Avoid while wielding a sword. Plus 13 Avoid while wielding a sword. Then we have plus 5 HP for bulk. Plus 2 Defense for bulk. And then this is also here because I don't have Special Dance yet. Ill decently like Dorothea, obviously not a bulky person, but I'm trying, you know? I've done what I could to make my dancer, who shouldn't even be in combat anyway, a little bit of bulk, just in case that situation does need to happen. Because this gives the dancer the opportunity to get in there and actually dance in the middle of combat, you know? Like, plus 2 defense and plus 5 HP aren't much, but if you stack all four of these together, that's respectable. It's not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Pegasus Knight. I don't think I can even fit anything else into her. Like, maybe... Yeah, no. Okie doke. And, oh, wait, no, we need combat arts. Mainly just because we got that new one for... The Lady, whatever her name is... Might increase based on a unit's res. Ooh, god damn. Fuck out of here, Smash. You know what? Focus Strike I could totally see, actually. Just because if we're ever fighting, like, l like late-game assassins and whatnot are impossible, this, this really helps with something like that. Back one space, forward one space. It just does a shitload of damage, which kind of what we need. <laughs> I'm surprised healing focus actually did something. It's not great, but it did something. Now, what is in closer? That prevents the enemy from moving. That's actually not that bad. It's if I need it, you know, it's a niche thing. Dead Eye is for range, and Closer is for stop being, you know? There you go. And... Finesse Blade, based on units and decks. It also just flat has pretty solid might on top of everything else. I'll take it. It's not great, but it's not bad. You're fine. Yeah, Alright, looking good. Looking cute. Looking sexy. And now we do a fucking paralogue and then we do more story missions. And this is the really tedious one because it's on a beach. Whole bunch of movement inhibitors. Oh boy, my favorite. Brother, please wait. For the last time, Flame, the answer is no. You are we've, departing we've for seen the before. You will do no so. We we, we know this. But one. I must. Like you you can't you can't just skip the cutscene for ones we've seen before, you know? Surely 
It's, hey, there's a bunch of the fucking church from before being assholes, and they're causing problems near where Flane's and Flane's mom is buried. You know? So they're just like, yeah, and then Flane wants to go defend them, you know, go save the area, so they're saying no. Now they're both coming along with us to be like, hey, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll protect Flane. Yeah, there you go, that's the plot. Don't like skipping cutscenes, but I'm only skipping cutscenes we've seen before because while I like cutscenes, I don't like seeing old content. Those are the only kinds of content we skip. Oh, hell no. Lysithia is getting the hell in. Oh, I have to deploy Flane instead of... That's right. <sighs> Let's look at the levels. She's level 20, no. Level 20. Wait, doesn't he? Go. I think he needs a shitload of class master, but I'm not sure. The one exception is Dorothea, who will, of course, be coming, just because you probably should. She only is just now allowed to do things, you know? She's not her new class. It didn't automatically assign it to her. Never mind! Get back out of the party. I would assume, just like every other time, it would be the, don't you want to equip the new class? I think I can actually play through that, like, right here. Can't I? Yeah. Crisis averted. I don't look odd or anything, do I? I mean, you do, but we don't really like to talk about it. You heretics who defile our goddess! The sacred coast belongs to us, the Western Church! You are the heretics! Be gone from here at once! Silence, dog of the apostates. That's some Prepare genuine rage. I like it. It's fun. <laughs> they're right. They're like Bonnie. justifiably the mad. You know. Focus on removing the surrounding enemies. Wait, brother. I shall. You will do no such thing. Yeah, most of them already mastered their classes. Wasn't it Hubert? Oh, he's not even fucking here. Never mind. Yeah, everyone's master their class, except for Byleth, actually, huh? Odd. I guess it makes sense. I typically don't do as much of them as I could logistically. Battle. Ugh, battle. Thank you. Guide me well. That's my cue. First time seeing the big old dancer, and now we'll pretty much never see this animation again because I'll be fast forward in the hell through. Welcome, Dorothy, to being able to play the fucking game. Oh, Lord. Stride activates if you dancer them. I never actually noticed that. That's amazing. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. Oh, <laughs> that is so good. I don't know why I'm doing that play when... Oh, yeah, that'll kill her. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing that play when I know I already have all my classes mastered and there's no reason to be doing what I was doing. Me in there. Well, get me in there. What a jump. Wait, Ferdinand, you have Oh here he has death blow equipped, okay. Yeah, he's a weird one. He's he's not a flyer and yet he has ready stance. He is a weird thing. He's a brigand with ready stance. <laughs> These are odd times we live in. As expected. Yeah. 
Ow, damn. Uh, Byleth might be... Okay, no, they're being an idiot. Okay. Nice level. Nice charm and luck, I think it was. <laughs> He's really striving for greatness. Oh no, it wasn't luck, okay. You can see Death Blow starting to really come in. Like, he hit for like 23 times 2. Ridiculous damage. Mainly relevant if you can force the double. No counterattacks. Bad. why focus strike is nice because I don't even need to guarantee it you know but just make it so I cannot actually miss it's just it's just nice it's so nice to get that hard line guarantee because it is an axe you know they do have the lowest accuracy of all the baseline martial weapons duty to worship Saint Kiho. We will not allow heretics to come near. Oh, that's right. You heal. I didn't see you had Nosferatu. Oh, that's why I should pay more attention next time. Hmm? That's right, me. How could I be such a so incompetent? didn't give it your all. We must all do a... How much are you about to do right to my teeth? Thirteen, not too bad. It's still rare to go. Luckily, Lindhart's casually just a god when it comes to being able to just, just artillery heal people. Lysithia doesn't have physic. Lysithia doesn't have fortify. Or yet, I guess, because we don't, I don't know if she learned those They're later. Just so vulnerable. How did you hit with a 40%? That's bullshit. 
That class mastery. Hey, Deathblow! Wow, who could have foreseen something like this happening? Wow, wow it's a real... Oh, man, uh, Santa got me exactly what I wanted. Santa seems to know exactly what I want. And that's lethal! Ooh, can I one-hit you? Yes, I can! Oh, assuming that 95 hits. Body and mind. Nice. And another free lemon Honestly, Wind Sweep is fucking amazing. Because I can use it on a training sword plus, so it has so much durability, it doesn't matter. And it just forces a raw damage check, you know? Because it's a training weapon that has very low base power, so Wind Sweep doesn't have very much base power, so it almost pretty much exclusively goes off my base strength and might, strength and might, and all that good stuff. So, giving Byleth. Death blow makes wind sweep hit like a fucking truck, and it's on a goddamned. <laughs> and it's on a dang old. What's it called? Training weapon, so. I, I don't remember the point I was trying to make. I, 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 I got flummoxed. I'm forgetting words that are attempting to come out of my mouth. It's really good because I hit really hard baseline without. I don't have good base growth, but I have good scaling. There you go, those are words. Assuming that they're words that actually make logistical sense to anyone else other than uh, me. One more success. Wait a minute, what do you have? Which one do you fuck? Oh, they can totally hit Caspar, but they're just deciding not to, I guess? Why is that? Don't you guys want to come pick a fight? Come on. Can they not? No, they totally can get right there. That's in the purple tile. Come kick Caspar's teeth in. Come on. Thank you. Oh, that dude hits way harder than that. Oh, that's actually not good. <laughs> <laughs> this is totally not good. This was beneath me. Hey, we got a crest crit with a different character this time. Normally the crest crit is like Felix's specialty, but Bernadetta can pop off all I the same. To challenge you. <laughs> I was expecting to do chip, but hot damn that worked out. Pretty good, don't you think? Ooh, that plus one defense might actually have just saved your life. Because the other dude's about to double you, so that's a fa oh, no he's not. Only one of them could get to you. I thought they could, like, move around to his right, but they must have fucked up how they moved. But but he was going to double him, so, you know, we can actually test, I believe. Assuming I have 5 less HP because he did just regenerate, he would have lived. He just healed for 5 HP, so he would have 3 HP. He would be living right now. 
It's part of the reason why I'm trying to get Bernadette to also become a brigand, because giving her death blow would really help, because she doesn't really do a whole lot of damage right now. So I am still trying to actively solve that problem. Caspar, save her life. I actually don't know no if, if he's still gonna me. do it, you know? Okay, now we're fine now. I missed like a 70 or an 80 or whatever, and then I hit the 50. This game really likes to play with my emotions. Should actually look at my promotions after this, because a bunch more characters got to level 20. A bunch of them already have master classes, so, you know. Did Caspar? No, I hear he had his master. Does one actually need theirs? I mean, yeah, the only other one's Dorothea, and she. it, it only makes sense for her to not have hers mastered yet. Alright, then. As expected. Seventeen times four off of a training gauntlet. Welcome to Death Blow. Does he have it? Yeah, he has a goddess ring. See, the only thing I could think of that would give him just passive regen is a goddess ring, which, yeah, no, he has. Nice. The goddess protects us. We will never yield to the likes of you. I was kind of half expecting one of those to miss, but no, we're not that unlucky this time. Pretty good, don't you think? Black Pearl. Ooh, charm by two. Irrelevant! Have you abandoned us? Well?
Whoa there, Birdman. You calm yourself. Oh, you, gotta, you, don't have, you don't gotta say the guy's nothing. He's a worthless human being. It's not nice. Let's, let's tone it down there, friend. I mean, well, now he's effectively nothing. He's a corpse, but I don't know. He's probably loot something off. You know, that at least has some value. Come on, man. Be practical about this. He's meat. He's, uh... You could donate his body to science. You could, uh... You could use him for a oddly, uh... Accurate and the ma and spooky haunted mansion. I can there's a bunch. There's a bunch you can use a corpse for. You just gotta use your imagination. Please don't kill Only Birdman. Cool by the way, I don't want him to die. It's a bad time. Greatness of. Okay, well, we're not dying yet. Heretics, prepare to taste the. Okay, bye bye. It's good talking to you. I got an advanced seal, guys. Aren't you that proud of me? Of, of course, brother. Isn't this a really interesting paralogue? It actually was, because you get some neat stuff out of it. Keyhole Cephleen. Your assistance is most appreciated. I can only hope that the Western Church will now see reason and abandon this place. But just to be safe, I have retrieved the holy artifacts. We cannot risk them. Yeah. Yeah. I must confess, despite the situation. Yes. This stone mark. It is also the grave of my wife. You are safe now, mother. Finally, you may find peace. I'm surprised people didn't. Like, this, this is the really first big theory of their whole thing. It's the grave of my wife, but it's also the grave of Blaine's mom? Hmm. <sighs> I suppose you have earned the right yeah. to know. But you can just also. Blaine is actually my yeah. daughter. <laughs> they do just my directly tell you, but you're just like, wait, what? Person. Here I thought we had hidden it skillfully. There are many who would seek to harm Flame due to the unique blood she bears. There's your neat lore. Falsifying her identity is necessary to conceal her from such individuals. Mercifully, I happen to look quite young for my age. We make rather convincing siblings, do we not? Mother loved the coast so much. I always just like set up and play. We've already seen this cutscene. I'm just enjoying it. It's, it's fun. I remember it fondly. Fish is my favorite food. It is true. I still come here to fish from time to time, using the skills my wife taught me. It reminds me how deeply I appreciate those years, and how I wish I could return to them. We cannot turn back the clock, Father. We must live our lives full. <sighs> You're right. Dwell too much on the past, and you may be unable to move forward. Goodbye, Mother. I love you. Oh, that's nice. So we got the Caduceus Staff. Ooh, yeah. Plus one magic attack range. Oh, baby. We just got a flat plus one range for... I think only attacking, I would assume as much, but I'm giving it to Lysithia. Now, hmm, yeah, I mean, she is the best murder man, you know? She also mainly only knows warp. She doesn't have physic, fortify, restore, recover, or any of that garbage. She just murders. It's kind of her job. 
The ball is tomorrow. I have no worthwhile memories of such events, yet I'm still looking forward to this one. As am I, in the sense that I look forward to destroying all of the unworthy suitors who will inevitably swarm Lady Edelgard. I will admit, Edelgard is adorable. However, when it comes to elegance on the dance floor, I am superior. You're not a bad dancer, Ferdy, but you do have some moves that are hard to watch. You honor me with your kind words. <laughs> I understand that I am sometimes too dazzling <laughs> to be into dense sack of bricks. I'm envious of your positive attitude. I also know how to dance, in theory. Maybe I should participate as well. Not me! You wouldn't catch me dancing at a ball any sooner than you'd catch a fish swimming through the sky! <laughs> well, you do tend to flop around like a fish on the land, after all. W why would you say that? Now I feel like a fish on a skillet. On a skillet? <laughs> Never mind. Speaking of the ball, do we get to pick who we dance with? I wonder who I should ask. A bold subject change. Should Lady Edelgard wish it, I would be honored to. I will fight with all that I have within me. Fighting? No, that's not really the point. I will not be as a fish upon the flame. Um, okay. You're very energetic. I have a proposition. Let's all agree to meet back at the monastery exactly five years from today. Like a class reunion? It's a great idea. Five years from today will be the Millennium Festival for Garrig Mach Monastery. I've heard the magnitude of the festivities will exceed all prior years. Oh, how exciting! Sounds like a great excuse to come visit our dear professor. You will be seeing how much growing I have done. You will be pleased, professor. This idea is good. You're not going to have done much in five who knows years. That's a fact. Who will be in five years' time, or who we will become? Still. I have faith that all of us will gather and celebrate our reunion. That's assuming the professor is still here in five years, and not enjoying a cozy early retirement. <laughs> Even if that's the case, you will come, won't you? Whether or not you're still teaching here. Don't forget, my teacher. Even if the Millennium Festival should be cancelled, I promise to return here. What month is it right now? Ooh, 12. We're actually getting very close to the moment. There's also a few months like left in the game before the time skip. I gotta hurry the fuck up. I wanna get to new content. We're so close. But it's still a little bit of a ways off. Unfortunately. I don't think we're doing it today. We're an hour and a half in and we um, yeah, haven't even done another story mission. So many social links, so little time, and they do take a while. Where's Claude and all this? <laughs> He's being a rabble rouser in the corner. Of fucking course he is. I want to dance with Claude. Get him. Get your ass over here. Come dance. It's dance time. Let's go. <laughs> Running away. Aren't I supposed? Wait. Aren't I supposed to pick who I hang out with in the I tower? Ah oh, shit! Time to breathe in is that isn't that a thing I have to? Don't I talk to the gate? Oh, to I forgot to talk to the gatekeeper. How could I have been such a fool? Poor, poor professor. I don't know if that's this month though. Ah oh, fuck! Was that a joke? I wish they'd give me a little bit more of an abrupt warning you. for that. I Just forgot. Of all the students begging I'm a you bit to of dance. a clod head. I'm a bit dense. I'm forgetful. But where is there to run? This place is filled with joyful students looking. I'm a dance. strainer that's a little bit too finely ground. I don't let everything in or out too efficiently. Ah, I see. The goddess tower waits for you. Don't be Bernadetta, please. Don't be Bernadetta. I don't give a damn who, just not Bernadetta.
You're really holding me in suspense here, ain't you? Are you fucking? <laughs> Oh man, it's a uh, look at all this old content we see. Oh, what's a so real unfortunate? Oh, uh, wow, who did? Uh, who, uh, what's uh, what cutscene? Oh, you guys are talking about. Oh, sorry guys, I accidentally hit the the start button. Uh, the skip the cutscene. Oh shit, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to skip it. Well, my bad. Oh darn. It was a, it was a, it was a real, it was an accident, you know, it was a misclick. It seems that everyone's accidentally, I accidentally time. deleted the, uh, the, that email in my inbox. How dull of you. Had I a body of my own? Oh, I would sing and dance until I fell apart. I feel this game is trying to tell me something and yet I actively fight it. Do as you will. Oh, you're not the only one who feels that way. Hi, Rhea. Look over there. Okay, bye. Mm, I'm bored beyond compare. Will you not follow her? Oh, come on, hurry up. I know that you are curious to see what she is up to. I hear someone. Oh, sleep. this again? Okay, let's. I think this might be the same cutscene. Yeah. Actually, no. I do I do good. believe we have seen this no, one before? No. I... Yeah, yeah, yeah. There he goes. Oops, we passed out. My bad. Let's look at them certifications. Level 20 or higher. Is he mad? He has mastered it. Oh, okay. So he's mastered being a brigand? Welcome to being a sword master. I hope you enjoy your stay. Heroes aren't as good. Heroes are one of the few advanced classes that are very meh, you know? Also, I've never had Bile be an actual sword guy, so I'm like, hey, you know. It does feel like the obvious answer, because Bob is a fire of the protagonist guy wield a sword! Gotta be a swordy! I've, I've always fought against that, but I'm like, hey, you know what, let's have some fun. Why not try out something new and exciting? Avagard has not mastered her class yet. She still needs to master being a brigand. I'm, I don't have a game plan for her after this, so, though, so... She will eventually become a warrior, but also the time... The whole time skip's coming up, so who really knows what's gonna happen with her? She's very close, though. After this battle, she should get it. Hubert, obviously, we've, we've had problems with Hubert. I don't... Yeah, Hubert's fine, though. It's, it's not too bad. Ferdinand. Ooh. Actually, let me, let me go through this. What does everyone need to become? Yeah, Hubert doesn't need to really worry about that. Once he's mastered his next thing, he doesn't really need to master the advanced class. Ferdinand... It's a jumping off point at the very least. Did you master those? Yes, you did. This will give him some nice passive flying experience anytime he engages in combat. Ah, yes, Ferdinand. Obviously, Wyvern Rider. Upon seeing him, he screams, Flyer. A true noble Plus never two strength fails. is also not bad. Holy shit. And I need a new flying class for him. Fantastic. Lindhart? Well, here's your warlockness. Also, it does seem you need to master being a dark mage to be able to become a dark wizard I man. Passed. Well. And plus four defense. Now that's not bad. Yeah, black tome fair, black man as he uses times two. By the way, Lindhart's done. He's not moving anymore. He's just gonna stick with us because there's not a whole lot he can become in like master classes. 
being a mage. I mean, another Dark Knight? We don't need another mounted unit, you know? We already have too many. It's good to have a few on the ground. Mortal Savant? Oh, hell no. <laughs> He's not gonna pick up a sword just to, just to be able to be a master class. I mean, Holy Knight? Holy Knight's not even that good. And I want to try it out, you know? See what it's all about. Caspar? Ooh. Now, Caspar is the really fun one. I need more pen seals. I'm a bit... Running a little low. Okay, so... One, two, three, four, five... Okay, just... Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I need to buy seven. Seems odd. I don't remember having to buy them in just such an aggressive bulk, you know? I remember getting... Don't you, aren't you supposed to get, like, five or something? I don't know. Either way. Not ready. Not ready. He's another one of the fun ones. Also, the fact that I'm not constantly promoting everyone does save a little bit of cash, not having to expend, expunge money for Master Seals. As, for example, Caspar is now done. We're not making him a War Master, and we'll see why later on. We're, are, we're not even at the time skipping. People are already almost done with their classes. Lindhart's done. Caspar's done. Bernadetta. I was gonna make her her only... The only other thing she needs to be now is a brigand, but she can't yet, so... We have to wait on her. She's literally just waiting for her to get brigand stat, because she has none advantage. Like, she doesn't need to master being a sniper, you know? It'd be nice, but it's not that important. The only good thing about it would be the growths, but she can still get growths off being, you know, a brigand, and I'd rather have death blow. Dorothea doesn't ever need to be promoted again, because she's never going off dancer. Petra. Also done. But I, I said this at the beginning. We were making her an assassin. Obviously, we're making her an assassin. I have six. Yeah, she mastered Pegasus Knight to get Darting Blow, and now she has ready stance for being a flyer. Now she's channeling all that super spiked, massive drugged and doped up evasion into being an assassin, which already has godly evasion. And finally, Mr. Felix, who's technically not even done yet, because he also needs to be a brigand, but, eh, well. Oh, there's also Lysithia. Here you go, Lysithia. Hers isn't... You know what? I actually don't even need to make her a bishop. Mastering bishop doesn't get her much. It just affects her growths. I am actually one advanced seal short, so there's no reason to do that. Nah, fuck it, you know? Yeah, good enough. Salvation of the Chapel. Yes, this should be the fun one. Captain? Captain! Where are you? Hey, too bad. I'm, I'm back. Sorry for the delay. Captain! Thank goodness you're here. Nonsense. I haven't heard it. That's why I'm heading there now, to see what's really going on. Of course. We're both... It's odd. They were apparently acting strange, as though they... Shortly after, demonic beasts started to appear. Yeah, this is the student rescue one. I actually forgot... I keep forgetting this mission exists in the game. I've done the one playthrough, which I actually still haven't even beaten on my own time. And I also forgot this mission was in the game. I thought this is the Gerald one, the but no. Students. There's no way to... But none of that matters. Wait, no, this is the we one. We need to act. Go oh, yeah, Damn. no. The I next one is the... Byleth redesign, and then I think it's time skip, because I think it's like three more months until the end of the game. Maybe four. I might be forgetting one intermediate there, because this is the... This is the Geralt one. Redesign. 
build up to time skip? No. There's like... Oh yeah, there is the one extra, like, defense... Castle defense mission. Yeah. But I don't... that That's when the new content, really. So, like... That's, like, after the next month is typically when the new content supposedly is coming out, so... That'll be fun. Play and get the fuck out of here. Does Felix need to... I wish I could see how close they are. Because I need to, like, go in here, you know? Oh, he's done. Oh, he's done. He just doesn't need to... Oh, um, what? Oh, no, he's mastering Mage. That's right. But no, he doesn't need to master his very much. It get, does give him Fiendish Blow, and that's amazing, but he doesn't need it for a promotion. Felix does, though, so I'll put in Felix. Even though Hubert needs him more XP. Should be good. Ah, uh, 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 I forgot something. Ferdinand is now a flyer. So, I need to give him a battalion. A new one. And we'll hopefully, you know, work for him. Anything better? Actually looking better, because it's, uh, it's three tiles compared to two. Yep. Does every single person have these? Oh, that's Flane. I don't give a damn about her. What did Ferdinand have equipped? He should have had another... Merchant military, shouldn't he have? Yes. Sorry there, Geralt's mercenaries, but... King, the King of Lion Corps is really fucking nice. It's another, that's another amazing one. It's more of a flex option, though, because it's like... They do similar things, but this one technically has more, you know, and it can be used twice, which is why I'd probably like it more. But it does require, have a higher requirements, I guess, you know? Okay. Now is battle time. There really are demonic people. I'll head that way. The rest of you. Help me! <laughs> you stupid... Okay. And just like every other demonic... Oh, there's a fucking chest here. Nah, oh, fuck him. I will prevail. Who needs XP? No one. Because it's time for fast. Well done. Flappy sleeves, get out of here. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. Send these three up here. Fuck it. Uh, and then the rest of the team. That's my cue. I can actually dance him because I've always had a problem with getting him back up to the front lines. Well, not a problem anymore now, now is it? Leave it to me. Stay focused. Now's our chance. Don't miss. Those are the worst. You only get one use of those. If it misses, it feels terrible. I'm here to help. In this situation. Thank you for the free umbral steel. I will get the victory. happen to be a knobhead and send Felix along with these people. As Felix, why the fuck do you still have a group lance attack? God damn it. And I never refreshed his battalion, so if he gets hit, he's just gonna piss it away. Fantastic. And 
there goes his battalion. And I think the main redeeming quality of those is the fact that they had two charges. I don't have two charges now. East. I'll just have to break it a more traditional way, now won't I? Accuracy forehead. Oh, we actually have new animations because of the new class. Interesting. Wait, how did they fully break it? Was he weak to swords or something? No idea. Apparently, she managed to fully break him in one uh, with one double swing, which is super nice, actually. Oh, he's a brigand! He doesn't actually get the extra range from being an archer. That's kind of annoying. It's not unbelievably detrimental, but it's more a minor inconvenience when you have to use more combat arts. Fancy new animation. Look at this boy float. Imagine you being such a stylistic boy that you have to flex on these kids by just wasting my... your magical potency to start levitating the fuck around. You gotta, you gotta inflict style points whenever you are in war. Because even though you may win, you may lose the war, you may lose the battle, but you won in a theatrical sense, and that's the most important victory. Make them tremble. Let the lesson begin. You gonna learn today, boy. Crit is now online. Get your ass over here. Hurry up and master being a brigand. Oh, this is gonna take him a while. He's priority number one, because I just want to stop dealing with his low ass uh, range. beginning of the end for what is considered common decency when it comes to the amount of goddamn big beast boys that they throw into these battles. Whoa, did I get Holy shit! Nothing else I could even potentially have asked for is defense, but I'm not gonna complain with a level like that. Gambit's also kind of nice. Oh no, it doesn't generate from her. Damn. It would be nice if they were closer, I guess I'll say. Technically, it's not wrong. No time like the present.
I don't think I'm going to be able to break this one. I don't want to risk the damage, because this is 30, 20... Like, I have to kill this one. Because he's just going to do 30. This one isn't lethal. Nah, I'm missing out on one of them. They're not mandatory required, you know? They're not needed in front of their completion. I just like them. Such power dwells within. Truly amazing. Luckily, this is a really short mission. Like, uh, we're already almost done. They just consistently get longer and longer, though, so... Get ready for that. She also has a bad gambit. Why the hell do so many of them have bad gambits? Could have swore I had enough merchant military. Oh, she still has the flying one! That would explain it. She still thinks she's a flyer! Oh, I get it! I understand now, I'm learned. Need a hand? I've got an idea. Guard's not actually gonna get full mastery off of this. <laughs> this, is, this is horrible. <laughs> She's gotten two fights in and we're already done with the story level. <laughs> Broken. Eh, fuck it. Probably just gonna give the rest to Lysithia. Maybe I have. Ah, uh, no. There's no way by Like, she'll. He'll live. This big old monster man will. You really think you can keep going? Don't push yourself too hard. Thinking about what happened at Ramire Village, it's clear you've gotten the hang of being a leader. Maybe you should have taken command of me, too. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, don't! Aw, oh, damn it. Aw, oh, that's kind of annoying. It doesn't matter, but I wanted to come back. <clears throat> I have to try harder. Mmm, another good luck. She had three fucking defense. Yeah, this is exactly why I didn't want that to happen. Here, Felix, you want a little bit more XP? Please don't lethal him. Well, why would I even risk it? You know he's gonna do it. It's fucking Felix. Of course he's going to lethal them. This isn't a question. It's a statement of fact. Get the fuck out of here, Ferdinand. And then that uh, fuck, give the rest of the pilot. Why not? He's a good boy. He he gets, you know, a boss kill once in a while. Glory of progress. <coughs> it was so scary. And this is where the fun begins. <gasps> you saved me. Thank you. Five turns. A story mission for five turns? Why can't they all be like that? Ooh, so fast. <sighs> there isn't a trace of evidence to be found in the chapel. This must have something to do with Ramayr. Bari's not having Animal Crossing New Horizons. Wait. I need to look, learn how to or look huh? to see how to turn those Another off. Student? It doesn't matter much, but... Run along now. 
Thanks for all your help, sir. <laughs> <laughs> You're just a pathetic old man. How dare you get in the way of my brilliant plan, you dog. Run along now. Thanks for all your help, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Just do it again. You have like 13 charges. Come on, you can do it again. Huh? What are you doing here? You must survive. Oh shit, it's Birdman. Merely because there is still a role that I require. I forgot Birdman was in the game. Daddy-o, thou shalt be missed. My, thank you so much! So this is where your father lived. Hmm? Are you still crying? If turning back the hands of time was not enough to save his life, you must accept what came to pass was fate. Control yourself. Though Gerald's death was at the hands of wicked ones, a fate is still a fate. Oh, your father said to look for something here. He must have been referring to whatever is behind that bookcase there. Your father's diary? His handwriting is prettier than his face would suggest. Well, well. These entries here are from before your birth. He seems to have been writing this for quite some time. Hmm? Oh. Read that part there. Horsebow Moon. Year 1159. Day 20 of the Horsebow Moon. All is cloudy. I can't believe she's dead. Lady Rhea said she died during childbirth. But is that the truth? And still, the child she traded her life for doesn't make a sound. Didn't even cry at birth. Day 25 of the Horsebow Moon. It's raining. The baby doesn't laugh or cry. Not ever. Lady Rhea says not to worry about a baby that doesn't cry. It isn't natural. I had a doctor examine the child in secret. He said the pulse is normal, but there's no heartbeat. No heartbeat? Day two of the Wyvern Moon. Sunny. I feel I must take the child and leave. But the church is always watching us. I don't know what Lady Rhea has planned. I used to think the world of Lady Rhea. Now I'm terrified of her. <laughs> 